This video shows how device diagnostics are incorporated in daily work practices from a maintenance console. While monitoring device health, it doesn't matter which page is open. Process variables, configuration or diagnostics. It does not matter which device is open. In fact, most of the time no device page is open at all because technicians do not watch the maintenance console all the time waiting to catch a failure. It is impossible to keep an eye on hundreds or thousands of devices. All devices are continuously monitored by software regardless of device or page displayed. In this example, there is currently no active alert as indicated by the inactive bell icon. Failures are detected by device self-diagnostics and reported to the software using digital communication. Depending on the protocol, the software is either alerted by the device or the software periodically pulls the devices. When a device failure is caught by the software, an alarm will sound and the icon is activated regardless of the device or page displayed. Click to reveal the active alert list. Click on the device and select Diagnostics. The content and structure of the diagnostics display is completely controlled by the device manufacturer, not the system manufacturer. The display is designed using EDDL to make the particular device easy to maintain. Failure of sensor 1 is clearly indicated by red in the navigation area on the display tab and pinpointed down to the plain text fault description. The fault is also illustrated by a conditional image. The diagnostic tells the technician it is a genuine device problem, not a process problem, identifying the device and problem area. The problem can be resolved quicker. Once problem is resolved, the conditional image instead shows a normal device. The healthy device disappears from the active alert list. Use EDDL to effectively incorporate diagnostics into daily work practices.